Governor Parson says he expects social distancing to take place in the state for months. I spoke one-on-one -on -one with Parson about his expectations for the future. As we could see nationwide or Missouri, nobody was really prepared for this. And then what you got to realize is you got to get prepared every day. Every day you come into the office, you had to start thinking, how do I prepare for this day and how do I prepare for tomorrow because nobody knew what was going to happen. You're going to have to have a new form of lifestyle a little bit to where social distancing is part of that. And whether it's a restaurant, you know, you may open up a restaurant again, but it's probably not going to be table after table after table that you're going to set there. We're probably going to have to make adjustments to that. I think the business owners will make that as we see now. But I think it, there'll be a change of lifestyle for us for a while. And we got to gradually do this. You know, one, we got to make sure this don't have a surge and come back. So, I mean, that's the one thing we're all looking at. But look, you can't keep people at home uh, in this state. Uh, everybody stepped up their game. They've, they, they got their A game on here. People stayed home. They did what's been asked to do, and we see that. But, you know, at some point, people's got to live a life, and, and we got to weigh all that out. So, and, and that's a tough decision every day. You know, I've been at this now for almost 30 days, coming in here 30 days, and, you know, it's, it's dang if you do and dang if you don't. And, and I get that, but at the end of the day is how do you move Missouri forward? And you got to make those decisions uh, and move forward. I, I'm not for sure exactly how I can answer that today to know what that is. One, when there's more testing done, when we know who's affected, who's not. I think one of the things, the more testing we do, we're going to find out who's already had the coronavirus and who hasn't. And we're going to get some sort of idea of safety on that as we move forward. And, and then I think as we go forward, we're just going to have to see. But it's going to be months. Uh, before we can ever make that decision where everything goes back to normal, people can get out and you don't have social distancing. It's just going to be for a while. But I think there's going to be a demand for certain things. I think customers are going to want to go back to business and they're going to feel safe. Now, whatever it takes for them to feel safe, I think the employers, the business owners are going to adjust to that. Uh, I really think that's what's going to happen in here because I don't know how easy people's going to want to go travel again, for example. How, much, how quick do you want to get in an airplane? How quick do you want to get in a hotel? So, you know, there's things like we're looking at from the state level. You know, maybe now's a great time to, to promote inside the state tourism. Maybe now you just have to put a tank of gas in there and you go to anywhere in the state you want to do that. So there's things you can do to help the economy and get people moving and be safe. But I think safety is a priority.